Hi, I'm Jessica Marksbury for Golf.com, and today I am lucky enough to enjoy a round with the beautiful Kira Kazantsev. Hello, Welcome, Kira. Cheers. Cheers to you. We're at the stunning resort at Pelican it's Hill. Gorgeous here. Newport Coast, California. So you were Miss America 2015. Yes. Talk to me about that whole experience. How does one become Miss America? It's a loaded question. Uh, so it, it's a long process. You have to win a local and then a state title and you move on to the Miss America competition. Uh, as Miss America, you serve as the National Goodwill Ambassador for Children's Miracle Network Hospitals. Uh, you have to have your own personal platform. Mine was uh, domestic violence, love shouldn't hurt, protecting women against domestic violence. Uh, you work a lot with the military. I went around the world with the USO. Uh, so the process of getting there is really preparing uh, to be able to be a part of all those experiences. So uh, lots of interview prep, lots of eating healthy and being very conscientious about your body for the swimsuit competition, uh, studying constantly, you know, the wardrobe preparation, a, a lot more goes into it than people think and it's the most wonderful opportunity in the world if you and it will change your life if you let it. So let's talk about your involvement in golf. You're mm -hmm. you're the first Miss America in I think over a couple decades a long that's time. been involved I'm Kylie and Marker loves golf. played golf. Um, <laughs> it's been a while. Uh, it's it's funny because our um, our security director at Miss America every year I guess he was telling me that when uh, Miss America is crowned she comes off the stage and the first question he asks you know beyond her safety is do you play golf? And the question is usually no um, until I came along. And he also is the uh, security director for the BMW Pro-Am. And he uh, got me to play that tournament. And I went from not having played competitive golf in 10 years to I'm all of a sudden playing golf on the Golf Channel. And there's- You're these, inside the ropes. I, uh, inside the ropes. Spectators. People are following <laughs> me with cameras. Peop, the the, the um, commentator man is slowing down my swing. <laughs> you know, I've entered into this whole new world of golf and um, being in the spotlight with the sport. And I've, I'm absolutely loving it. I'm enjoying every single second. and. I get to have a round with you, so it's fabulous. <laughs> well, golf is such a wonderful game, as we know. It gives you so many great experiences, mm -hmm. and especially in your position where you're being invited to these mm -hmm. great pro-ams, you're meeting PGA Tour players, and I, in fact, I heard you, you even met Tiger Woods. I did. Uh, I got to play in Tiger Jam, which um, is a great event that Tiger Woods does every year at Shadow Creek in Las Vegas. It's a wonderful fundraising event, and they give back to kids that might come from very non-privileged backgrounds that need help with their education, and um, so they do wonderful work. But I, I was walking up to the golf course. I was with Chris Harrison, who is the host of Miss America. Uh, he always uh, plays in, at Tiger Jam, and Tiger is there uh, giving a, a lesson to you know a group of people that had been able to to come out to the course to meet him. And he comes over and he and I was like, well, you know, hi Tiger, nice to meet you. I'm a big fan of yours and I play golf. And he goes, really? And I said, yes. And he goes, okay, let's see it. And he handed me his club. <laughs> like, maybe I should just crawl into a hole and die. Um, but I hit two perfect chips right in front of him and he looked at me and goes, okay, you can play golf. Great. And we stood and had a great conversation and I was like, all right, I could probably die now. It's fine. Could there be better praise? No, seriously. Oh, it was, wow. You know, and I grew up with with Tiger playing golf, um, it, my whole life, you know, Tiger Woods was always you know, the end all be all of golfers. So, um, and he still is. So, uh, I was really, really honored that I got that little bit of FaceTime with him and that, you know, encouragement that yeah. yes, you can play golf. So, if Tiger Woods says it, it's true. <laughs> I don't know if, if anything could top that really, but what's next on your golf bucket list? What are you hoping to my accomplish? My golf bucket list? Well, I've never played golf outside of America. So I love to go and play in like Scotland or Ireland or something like that. St. Andrews would be like my, like I would die to play that course. <laughs> um, but if we're talking domestic, um, I'd love to, I've never played Pebble. So that's my my next project that I'm working on. So we'll see. Did you hear that everyone? Yeah, if I'm... you have an invitation for <laughs> Kira, right? Pebble Beach it is. Mm -hmm. Well, cheers to you, Kira. Cheers. I'm sure that will happen. I'm sure too. Somehow, <laughs> some way you can get out there. I'll bring there. pina coladas, it'll be great. <laughs> it's been an absolute pleasure. Thank, Thank you. you so much Thank for you your for time. Me.